guys uh, welcome to the is guide see in this video we will be looking into how to prepare for sociology optional for uh, civil service exam and we will be looking into how to prepare in online mode okay even the details how to prepare offline also i am going to tell you people in this video okay and this video is presented by me is guide and let me see what will be explaining in this video regarding how to prepare sociology optional okay see first uh, we will be telling the contents the contents means uh, what is the time required to prepare for sociology optional will be dealt in the first chapter in the second chapter how to begin this kind of preparation that is sociology preparation from scratch okay and the third chapter no we will be dealing into each and every book which has to be studied for sociology optional okay we will be taking each and every chapters and we will be telling which are the books you have to refer for those chapters okay in detail book we will be telling and uh, when it comes to the role of test series we will be telling what is the role of uh, means test series when it comes to sociology optional why you have to write okay what are the pros okay definitely there are no cons actually what are the advantages of writing uh, the uh, test series sociology okay that we will be explaining and at last i will be telling what is the support which i will be giving from my side for you people with regard to sociology optional okay let's begin let's uh, actually take up the first chapter that is what is the time required to prepare for sociology optional okay see a different scenario will be there okay let us take first case okay in the case of full time aspirant the aspirant who is actually studying for the civil service exam full time for him no around uh, definitely he require around uh, 3 months uh, to prepare for sociology optional on an average of 5 to 6 hours per day fruitful study okay see the meaning of fruitful study is 5 to 6 hours concentrated study is required uh, around 3 months to actually complete the syllabus 100% Okay, that is what is required for a full-time aspirant. And let us see what about the working aspirants because in civil service exam, uh, seventy percent of the aspirants who are giving the civil service exam will be working, and they, then they will be preparing, working plus preparing. Okay, so that is the reason uh, we will be taking those uh, cases also in the play in the in the case of working aspirants. Definitely require little more time. Okay, not too much more time. Little more time he require around let us say five months he requires if he study around four hours per day. Okay, consistently four hours per day. If we study, definitely in five months we can cover hundred percent of the sociology syllabus. Okay, but the point to be noted is consistency. Regularly he has to read. He or she has to read. Okay, and the only way to save time is to read minimum number of books, which are very much standard books. Okay, read minimum number of books, read minimum number of materials, and take full advantage of internet facility which is available. Okay, today no internet ka dunya hai. Okay, we get internet in very low cost. That's the reason you have to make full advantage of internet facility. Because if you make full advantage of internet facility, no need to join coaching and all. Okay, no need to go and join coaching. Okay, to go and join coaching only, you will take one month. Okay, you will take. Uh, you will ask opinions about uh, the coaching for uh, some friends. Okay, you want to go to metropolitan cities. Okay, if you are not staying there, you have to go to Delhi. You have to go to Hyderabad. Simply waste of time. Okay, and you have to save times here by using the online content. See, today everything you will be getting in online. Okay, bombard content will be getting in online when compared to the this uh, coaching uh, institutes. Okay, better than them in online you will be getting the services. Make best use of the services, okay. And also the time, no, to traveling time will be reduced. Simply going to tuition, okay. Naya um, kapde, okay. Daily you have to wear you know, class. Daily you have to travel for some one or two hours, okay. It's a waste of time actually. Yeah, that's the reason you have to minimize all this traveling, all this kind of fundas, and you have to sit in the home, take the facility of internet, and prepare and be confident of cracking this exam. Okay, as much as you travel, as much as you find. Uh, answers for the coaching in outside definitely that much chances of failure is high okay simply roaming and uh, you, will, you will waste the time there only okay where, where studying and all okay that's the reason do not roam and all just sit in one place if you get the access to the material just take the material study yourself and be confident of cracking this exam and internet is the best facility for this one okay makes best use of internet instead of running outside okay this is how the time management has to be done and let me explain about how to begin sociology optional preparation see first uh, uh, to begin you have to just go to the upsc website see in the upsc website there you will be finding the syllabus of sociology option okay first you see 
how the syllabus is there okay for paper one some ch 10 chapters is there okay we all know that in sociology optional there are two papers okay in every optional there are two papers and in sociology also there is two papers <coughs> paper one as well as paper two okay see paper one will be having uh, some uh, <coughs> 10 chapters if you see in sociology optional and in paper two we will be having three chapters and let's say three sections will be having in paper two okay just to see what are the topics which are mentioned in the syllabus and have an basic understanding about those topics okay after having a clear-cut uh, basic understanding about the topics what you have to do is you have to go to the same website UPSC website and collect three previous year papers of sociology optional okay even if you don't understand at the starting you just read out the questions yourself and you think that how the nature of the questions are coming in the UPSC exam but because in the future it will be very helpful okay starting you have to read the three years paper question by question and think over it how the nature of question is coming okay once you finish with the syllabus scanning once you finish with the uh, previous years questions scanning the next is to start with books okay and the first book you will be starting with this one paul horton and chester hunt is the book which you have to start okay very basic and very nicely written and very simple language they have written high standard material is present in this book okay see many people will tell you that uh, you have to go for ncrts and all but i don't prefer for you people to go to ncrt because you are not a school kid to go and read ncrt books okay in up exam upsc does not never tells that go and read ncrt books it's your choice actually okay for gs things ncrt books are very much relevant but when it comes to optional definitely the questions which are coming in optional definitely they are beyond ncrt books and if you want to understand things please go to this book sociology by paul horton and chester okay just read this book then really you will like sociology and you will enjoy reading sociology if you build your basics from this book okay even exam point of view this uh, starting book is very good Paul Horton exam point of view also you can reproduce the answers from this book no problem 100% marks you'll get okay this is the books to begin and after reading this book you have to <coughs> read the standard books which I will be mentioning in the further okay first have a basic understanding by reading that book okay Paul Horton book then after uh, reading that book uh, you have to actually develop an interest in reading Yojana and Kurukshetra magazine. See, Yojana, no, it is a actually uh, uh, magazine which actually uh, writes about various important articles which are uh, national importance. Okay, articles which are concerned to the national importance will be written in Yojana magazine. Very bombarded book, and you have to uh, study this magazine. Okay, complete one year magazine you have to study. Previous one year from mains. Okay, and also you have to study the Kurukshetra magazine. Very important when it comes to sociology point of view. Okay, in Kurukshetra magazine they will write the developmental uh, works. Okay, all the developmental works they will cover in Yojana, Yojana magazine. That is the reason you have to cultivate a habit of reading Yojana and Kurukshetra magazine on a daily basis. Okay, and next thing you will be doing is making extensive use of internet facility which is available for you. Very cheap cost. Nowadays internet no it is very cheap cost that's the reason it is very good move by the government that they are they are providing internet facility at very cheap cost so that students can prepare in home only okay make use of uh, these things then let me tell you about uh, the books to read for this uh, sociology optional okay once you cover with the basic book what I have told Paul Horton and Chester once you cover that book you have to come and read these books okay uh, as i have told that uh, in paper one you will be having 10 chapters okay let me explain you about chapter wise okay the first chapter now it is actually related to the introduction of sociology and it also talks about the discipline of sociology okay to understand about the introduction of sociology you have to read the book by ronald fitcher the making of so sociology by ronald fitcher and also you should take the introductory chapters from igno material Okay, and the point to be mentioned, you have to read the MA IGNO material, not B IGNO material. Okay, many people will be telling you people to read B IGNO material, but believe me, you have to read MA IGNO material. And when it comes to the chapter two and three, the chapter two, no, it deals with the 
sociology as a science okay the discussion related to the sociology of science is related is contained in chapter 2 and in chapter 3 they tell about the various research method which are applying in sociology how research is done in sociology is dealt in chapter 3 and to refer to these two chapter 3 and 4 you have to study these two books the first book is very famous book harolambus book and this is foreign author book blue color book not orange book okay blue color book is a foreign foreign perspective book whereas the orange color book another book is there orange color book by the same author harolambus it is indian context but i will be referring for you to read the foreign context book okay and uh, the second book you will be reading is research method in social sciences by good day and hat very standard book okay you can also go for uh, research method by ram hoja ram hoja okay any book you take up and read it okay the first book <clears throat> by good day and that if you find good day and that very standard which you cannot comprehend then you can switch to ram hoja but i prefer good day and that okay and let me explain about the chapter 4 see when it comes to chapter 4 it is related to the sociological thinkers concept okay see thinkers whenever it comes to thinkers you can always go for lewis coser book sociological thoughts by lewis coser okay and you should go for weber marx and durkheim theory by morrison and you should also study social theory and social structure by martin and should not forget to study the igno material when it comes to thinkers section very important you do not uh, neglect igno material okay for thinkers section you have to read igno material apart from lewis coser okay in igno material you have to select uh, ma igno material thing concern to the thinkers section and you have to read okay and let me explain you about the fifth chapter it is related to the stratification the meaning of stratification is inequality chapter 5 which is related to the stratification is dealt in chapter number 5 and the books you will be reading is the same book harolambus book blue color book and deepankar guha very very standard book okay stratification by deepankar guha okay apart from that one you should be reading the sociology the introduction to sociology by the antony giddens book okay and at last you will be referring to the ma igno material which our relevant chapters are there concerned to the uh, stratification concept pick up from the ma igno material and read it and let me explain you about the chapter 6 which is related to the work economy section okay economic sociology deals with chapter 6 work economic okay all are equal okay it deals with the economic sociology and the book you will be reading is the same book blue color book by harolambus and the same book antony giddens book okay antony giddens book and uh, this book is a must you have to read for economic sociology okay economic sociology by uh, this uh, neil j smelser very standard book which is there in the market okay if you find it very difficult to buy this book because it is a little bit costly if you find it difficult to buy this book you can just uh, have an photocopy of this book okay that's it about the economic sociology let me go for chapter number 7 it deals with the concept of religion okay concept of religion is contained in chapter number 4 and these are the books you have to read okay the book by ashraf and sharma the book by johari the book by harolambus same blue color book and the book by tk oman okay highly recommended book tk oman book when it comes to the concepts of religion okay that's about the chapter 7 let me explain you about the chapter 8 see when it comes to the uh, just a minute guys just a minute one correction i want you people to make see chapter 7 is not about religion sorry bit mistake i did chapter 7 is not about religion it is about the political sociology sorry you have to correct this okay only this mistake i have made here it is about political sociology not about religion because i saw this comparative politics and i actually find it out the error okay see the error is i told that chapter 7 is related to the religion but it is not related to religion it is political sociology sorry please correct it and these are the books i'll repeat again astraf and sharma johari compared to politics and the same blue color book harolambus and uh, political sociology the concepts of nation state and citizenship in political sociology you have to take tk oman book and refer to it okay that's it and now let's go for chapter 8 here it is uh, religion okay this chapter 8 is concerned with religion and religion means always remember this book grace davis the book by grace davis is the only standard book which you people will be reading for religion concept okay apart from that one you should go for harolambus book that is blue, blue color book okay and when it comes to chapter 9 it deals with the concept of marriage 
marriage and also deals with the concept of family kinship okay all these concepts are dealt in the chapter 9 marriage kinship and family and the same book harlambus blue color book you will be referring and you will be referring to the igno material ma igno material okay that's it guys and let me go to the last chapter of uh, the paper 1 okay the last chapter no it deals with the social change very important chapter social change okay see to study social change you should go for the antony gidden book the same book which you will be referring okay antony gidden book you should refer for social change and also the relevant chapters from ma igno material pick up and read okay that's it about the paper 1 book okay let me explain you about the paper 2 book see when it comes to paper 2 there are three sections actually a section b section and section c okay let me explain you about section a see when it comes to section a uh, it talks about the introduction of sociology in indian context okay sociology introduction in indian context is there in uh, this section a and the book is indian sociology by nagle very standard book okay and you should also study social background of indian nationalism by very famous uh, author ar desai okay and the third book is modernization of indian tradition by yoginder singh very thin book and very important book and social reforms during british rule by kenneth jones okay these are the four books you will be reading for section a and when it comes to section b it deals with the social structure actually social structure of indian society okay see to study about the social structure when it comes to rural structure you have to study the book by ar desai and you have to take relevant chapters from this indian economy ncert book okay evolution of indian economy ncert book is there you just take relevant chapters concerned to the uh, structure of indian society and read it okay and you should read this famous uh, uh, author book srinivas m srinivas cast in india by m srinivas okay he has taken the examples of uh, that uh, kurg and all okay that kurg uh, which is there in the karnataka no Uh, M. S. Srinivas is from Karnataka. That's the reason he has uh, made certain studies from the parts of Karnataka, and he has written very nice book. He has written and cast in modern avatar by the same author. M. S. Srinivas, you have to read, and you should also read class, cast, and power by Ander Bittele. Very important author. Okay. Apart from that, you should also read the book Cast and Race by Gure. Okay, uh, Indologist, Indian Indologist Gure, and you should also read the same book. Deepank Kurguha for stratification. Paper one also this book. Paper two also this book. Okay, and you should study the Indian social system by Ram Hoja. Okay, Ram Hoja is a very famous author in India when it comes to sociology. You have to study his books. Indian social system by Ram Hoja, and don't forget to study the tribal concepts from Nadim Hussain book. Very detailedly he has covered about the tribal India. Nadim Hussain. You should also study about the developmental works in tribes by Rath. when it comes to developmental works many times in questions will come in exam and tribal thoughts throughout the ages by verma is a must read book also okay apart from that you should read the patrica oberai's book of family marry and kinship okay very simple concepts he has covered nicely about family about uh, marriage in india about uh, how the kinship groups are there okay what are the different kinds of kinship groups are there in india very nicely patrica oberai has covered that concepts and the last section of paper b is the section c which talks about the social change okay see to study the social change it is very interesting in india okay you have to study the uh, first you have to study the must read book is ram hoja book okay very small book but very nicely detailedly he has written about the, the society in india the concepts of society in india how the changes are taking place in india okay and don't forget to read this kurukshetra magazine last one year issue is a must for sociology option okay and you should also read the social background sociological background of indian nationalism by ar desai okay you should also read the modernization of indian tradition by yogendra singh as explained earlier you should also go for bhambri book uh, for polity and the same tk oman book national state and citizenship when it comes to political sociology is a must and social movements by the same author tk oman okay and you should go for some the dynamic i'm sorry for demographic concept okay demography is also a concept which you will be studying in this uh, sociology okay take relevant chapters from this chandana agrawal book uh, concerned to the demographic uh, concepts and read it okay these are the books you should be reading for sociology optional that's it guys the book seems to be very elaborated but these are the must read book what can be done 
okay it is not like geography sociology is not like geography if you take geography definitely within 10 books we can cover geography if you take public administration definitely within 6 or 7 books we can cover public administration but sociology is not like that it is actually extensive you will not get a single clear cut book to read in sociology these many books you have to consult to prepare 100% of the syllabus okay if you are having any doubts please let me know i'll be clarifying you people regarding anything you ask any doubts which is there in sociology i will be answering for you people any silly doubt also i will answer if you ask about sociology optional or general studies anything you ask i will be telling okay and uh, what is the role of test series in sociology you people might be asking okay see <coughs> many people think that sir what i will do is i will just uh, read mug up the books and i will just go and sit in the examination and write the exam see how it is possible you tell me okay this is not your uh, degree exam to mug up things and go and sit and write there okay you have to test several times before writing a mains exam okay whoever uh, even the successful candidate candidate might tell you that come on don't take test series but i don't believe that okay no successful candidates have told like that you tell me which candidate have told that uh, test series you should not take okay that means test series is a must to pass this exam even if you are running out of time also you have to test yourself right from the beginning otherwise it's not use okay simply reading mug- mugging up and going and sitting in the examinations actually you are only inviting your failure if you are doing like that okay no effort is fruitful unless you test it many times that's the reason highly recommended test series you right from beginning only you take test series according to me okay experienced words are not false okay believe me these are my experienced words from my preparation as well as from my lecturing career in this field civil service exam okay that's the reason test series is a must okay actually test series no it helps you to minimize the actual errors which you could do in the real examination definitely you people will do actual errors in the i'm sorry definitely will people will be doing some minor errors in the actual examinations from which you can fail that's the reason to avoid those failures you have to take practice test okay see and according to me definitely around uh, not less than 10 practice test you have to take in sociology before sitting into mains 10 practice test if you take i sh- i guarantee that you will be performing well okay and uh, another thing is see cultivate the habit of writing at least one descriptive answer on sociology on a daily basis it is actually enjoyable process no okay daily reading some concepts okay based on that concept writing test it is it is actually confidence building exercise you will be sure that you are you are going to write the answers okay if you are if you are able to write the answer on a daily basis whatever you study that day definitely you feel like uh, definitely i am going to perform well now in uh, exam okay that kind of confidence you people will get and read that kind of confidence is a must for this exam okay it's a confidence building exercise see believe me most of the people will not be doing this exercise it is an opportunity for you people to actually do this exercise to stand distinct from others in this competition okay keep this uh, success sutra in mind okay that's it now let me explain about what i can do uh, to help you people regarding sociology optional see i am conducting already it's ongoing okay we actually conduct sociology optional courses already ongoing it has just started okay just go and see the details all details will be getting for your convenience i will be telling the overall detail also okay uh the overall detail means the classes no 75 days continuous class is uh, going on okay just see the website you will be getting all the ideas 75 days okay daily 2 hours video uh, you will be getting through my website okay that means in total daily 2 hours means 150 plus hours video will be getting and in that video each and every concept minor concept also i have explained concerned to sociology okay no need to study extra things okay great effort i have taken to prepare this kind of uh, lectures okay very painful effort i have taken and fruitfully i have delivered the things okay it's left to you you just go and take the advantages and daily two questions i will be giving from my side to write the answers okay that means 150 questions daily two questions means into two 75 days into two 150 questions you tell me if you sit alone in home and if you actually are you able to write 150 questions okay actually you will not get a track to write that's the reason what i will be doing is daily two questions i will be giving from my side and i will be asking for you people to write the test 
Okay, that means 150 questions you will be writing in one booklet, and you will be keeping that booklet, and you will be daily revising that booklet. That means it is sure that you are going to pass this exam, and it is sure that you are going to pass with high marks in sociology optional. I guarantee that. Okay, and I will be conducting sectional test in sociology, and sectional test will be ten sectional test will be there. Okay, and four uh, full syllabus test will be conducting. Okay, sectional test will be ten, whereas full length test will be four. And point to be noted here: personal evaluation I will only be doing. That means I will only be checking your answer sheets, and I will be actually giving suggestions from my side. Okay, not like uh, uh, you people will be writing answer, and somebody P1 will be correcting uh, papers. No, not nothing like that. Okay. I am the person who has who is going to check your answer, and I am the person who is going to tell you that what should be improved in your answer. Okay, that is the very beneficial thing which I will be providing from my side. Okay, that's it, guys. This was a broader uh, actually overview about the online course which I am already conducting. You just go to my website; you will be getting all the ideas. Okay, this is my website. isguide.com you just go to this website okay each and every detail about the online course very bombard and very fruitful course and guaranteed course it is okay isguides.com okay this is the layout of my website okay you just go to this section here sociology section okay all the details you'll be getting here okay no need to worry and uh, i want to tell more about my website okay just see these are the actually some features daily editorial analysis will be there here okay daily around uh, 8 am morning i will be uploading uh, some 15 minutes video on a daily basis so that you can watch the editorial explanation here and you can get an actually uh, very good idea about the editorial things okay and uh, even notes you will be getting okay in this section daily editorial analysis notes now after watching the video you can just go to this uh, notes section and you can read the notes there okay very bombard notes i will be preparing uh, you just go to this uh, tab you will be getting all the details there okay then uh, apart from this uh, daily editorial analysis which i'll be giving for you people free daily apart from this one you can also go for this section okay this is a test series a prelims test series section okay test series section you just go and click here uh, that will uh, take you to the test series okay prelims general studies okay 40 test is there okay uh, it's uh, your convenient based on your convenient you can actually access your test and uh, here the name encyclopedia it is general studies course okay 150 days course it is general studies see you can also cover this 150 day course in actually 50 days okay it's left to you how much you prepare a day depends upon that one okay and this is already i said that 75 days online course sociology even the 75 days you can reduce to 40 days and you can cover within 40 days okay it's it depends upon your efficiency and your capacity okay very nicely i have covered okay all the details will be getting there okay video analysis all these are okay encyclopedia this is gs and sociology video tutorials complete courses there okay even test series is a part of this uh, gs as well as this sociology okay that's it guys and uh, once you enroll in any of the courses you can upload your answer sheets which i will be downloading from my side i will be correcting and then i will be uploading your evaluated answer sheets and i will be sending for your gmail okay all the features i have explained in that website just go to that website okay iasguides.com okay don't forget here yes iasguides.com just go to the website and be regular to that website all the things you will be learning through that website okay that's it guys if you have any queries you can just message me you just go to contact us here okay in website contact us okay email id is there my email id just go and message any silly doubts also i am going to reply you people within 24 hours okay uh that's it thanks for watching this video and any doubt let me know okay have a nice day guys and all the best for the examinations bye